They were like, this is one of our popular sellers. And I was like, all right, then I'll get one too. You know what? If my neighbors can hear me, they're gonna think I'm going psycho. And the most embarrassing thing is, ah! <gasps> okay, I need to calm down. Okay, bye. We are back in lockdown, which means I am back to spending all my money online. Turns out online shopping is my coping mechanism. Is it a healthy one? No. Am I gonna continue doing it? Yes. Last time we were in lockdown, I did a video on Wish. It was my first time experiencing the website. I tried to get some free and cheap stuff from there. And you guys really liked the video and you guys have been asking me to do it since. Um, and I just never got around to it. But now that we're in quarantine again, now seems as good as time as any. So let's go get some bargains on Wish, shall we? I literally just logged in and a pop-up came up saying I can get 50% off my order. Maximum discount is £77 per order and can be redeemed twice if I just put ready 50. Ready 50. Oh, I can get 50% off. What a lovely welcome back to the website. This is actually really cool. It's a vortex carpet. Okay, I do not need this in my life. But at the same time, I think I do. If this actually looks like this, then that is insane. For three quid, what an absolute bargain. Wish is a gift that keeps on giving. Wireless charger pad, phone, fast charging. Oh, I forgot how. I forgot how these description works. They just put random words in and hope that they make sense. You know what? Let's get it. So I got a wireless charging pad for £2.85. That ain't bad, yeah. Let's type in free and see what comes up. Apparently, I can get this exquisite white gold sterling silver ring for free. Sounds like a scam to me. Let's get it. Let's go to clothes. You know, I'm going through a tie-dye phase at the moment and they do look quite cool. Okay, I am gonna get myself some tie-dye pajamas. You know what this, if this works, this is very, very helpful. Pineapple is one of my favorite fruit, but one of the reasons I don't ever get it is because I'm too lazy to peel it and do the whole shebang. But apparently this thing will solve that problem for me, so maybe I'll start having pineapple again. Interesting. Bye. 79p, face small. Okay, this is really cool. Let's hope they have tata. I have an iron. But I never use it because I'm just really lazy and my ironing board is so bad, like it just drops. So I just can't be bothered. And I have been wanting to get a steamer because apparently they're really good for ironing clothes. But I just never got around to it. But they have a steamer on the Wish Out website. What an odd looking contraption. Just looking at it, I have no idea how I'm supposed to, how it works. Like it's very confusing to me. Let's get it corn on the cob but you can oh this looks really cool actually okay if this works this could be quite possibly the cutest gadget i've ever seen in my life free free what's our favorite word free we got something for free let's claim it do i want to have a wig moment kind of do oh my god it does look good though they do actually look really good you know what i do like this one i would want to test this one out as you can see my current hair state it's not that great. If I can have a much more fun wig moment, then why not? Oh my God, I got myself a wig. Love that for me. My cousin is the biggest Blackpink fan. Like she's obsessed. Um, and it's really hard to find Blackpink stuff. Um, they don't have a lot, like I tried Amazon and everything like that and it's just, it's really hard to find Blackpink stuff, I don't know why. So this is actually insane. Oh, a hoodie would be so, oh stop it. If this is actually good quality, I am gonna be gas. Okay, so this one has really, really, really good reviews. And for nine pounds, that's really not that bad because I feel like you can charge a lot of money for Blackpink stuff. Um, so I think I'm gonna get the black one. Please have it in the right size. These sizes make no sense. Okay, these sizing is so confusing. I feel like they just put a bunch of X's next to the size and it makes no sense. Oh, this is what I struggled with last time. The sizing system on Wish is so confusing. 2L, 2XL, 2XXL, 2XXXL, 2XXXXL. Bye! <laughs> I think one thing that's good about Wish is that you can find things on there which you wouldn't find in other places. So all these like cute little gadgets and all that, I wouldn't know where to go and find them. But on Wish, it's all there. And Blackpink, it's so hard to find Blackpink stuff. Um, 
But on here, they have some good stuff. I mean, I don't know the quality, that's the thing. You kind of you have to take a risk with the quality. But that's what we're going to be testing. Okay, so, order summary is £76.55 for the items, £77.99 for the shipping, which is wild. Never have I, in my experience, never have I <laughs> shopped anywhere where the shipping costs more than the actual product. But that's wish for you. And then the order total is £154.54. But I want to apply the coupon, which is READY50. And let's see if that works. Yeah! What? Wait, what? Oh, you unlocked 5% off your order. Maximum discount of £77. So I only got £3.83 off. Wow. Great, let's place the order. Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! Making all my wishes come true. So this is all the wish orders. It's a whole bag full of them. And I kind of low-key feel like Santa. First thing we have, I think this is the one I'm most excited about because the person I'm giving this to, if it goes well, it could be a really great happy moment. Black, pink, in your area. One, two, three. I think it's quite a nice fit. I think it's quite flattering. Okay, is it the best material? No. I like it a lot. But then again, I do love a good hoodie. What do you think? Yeah. Oh man, now I wish I got one. The quality is not the best. It's a bit like um, belt material, but it does feel warm and cozy. Yeah, feel it. It feels quite warm. Yeah, it'll keep you warm. For nine quid, this was. Nine quid for a hoodie. Oh my god, I'm so gassed. Ooh, this one I'm really excited about. Perfect to remove wrinkles and refresh your clothes on the go. Oh. This is what it looks like. Oh, it smells like a, fr a uh, scrambled eggs. This is the state of most of my clothes. It's just so wrinkly. And the most embarrassing thing. Ah! Whoa! It doesn't do anything. It's not doing anything. I mean, it is a cool way to do your clothes. I'll give you that. Oh, but it takes all, it takes all the arm energy. But it did work. Do you see that? That's actually impressive. Okay, like once you get it to work, that was very quick and easy and impressive, right? That area is smooth now. That's before. That's after. Oh damn! This is good. Ah! Ooh, this is so good. I'm sorry, but once I finally figured out how to use it, I think this is really good. It's so smooth. I think I found my new favorite gadget. Be careful, be careful. Look, it just did the whole arm. <sighs> I'm all steamed out. It's very unpredictable, but when it does work, it's a solid 10 out of 10. But it's like very impractical to hold and use. Compared to before, I think that's quite impressive. In what world is that impressive? Shake my head. <gasps> okay, this one looks good. Oh no. That's not very... Oh, is it like... Does it look like an illusion to you? It does... Oh, wow! You know what? I might just drop this in the corner and someone will be like... Oh my god! One, two, three. It's a novelty thing, but I actually quite like it. For three quid, that's not bad. For dinner, I have made myself some salmon with some veg and rice and some corn. Thought I would test out the corn stripper. Oh, it's like a little mouse. It's actually really cute. All of that corn has turned into... Yeah! I've got tie-dye joggers but it's not jogging material, it's like, oh no. This is the saddest looking happy thing I've ever seen in my life. You know what, I'd wear this as, pajamas. actually as pajamas, this is not bad. They're really, really thin. Yeah, they're really thin. I wouldn't wear these out. <laughs> I'd wear these in bed when no one else could see me. They're not bad material actually, it's not like too silky, it's a bit silky, but it's also kind of like cotton. I wasn't sure about these trousers at first, but now, they're really growing on me. I don't know if you can tell, but it's very grey and miserable in the UK all the time. It's great. Great for when you're trapped in a flat and got nothing better to do. So every now and again, I like to put a bit of colour in my life. And these pants, 
actually have lifted my mood. So we love, we stand. Another thing that has lifted my mood is my new merch. This one is my personal favorite. It's got I'm fine written all over it. <laughs> As a gentle reminder to me to keep saying during this 2020 period. If you want to grab merch in time for Christmas, then I would highly recommend you order now um, to get in time for Christmas. So yeah, grab it now. And then on Christmas day, you get a lovely surprise. I'll leave a link to the merch in the description box below. By the way, I drew that, that's all me. Just a little note to self to keep going, stay happy, do things to make you happy. Duh. <gasps> okay, I need to calm down. Okay, bye. It's Tata. The super fits, because you never know if they fit my face. <gasps> oh, what do you think of this? That fits quite well, actually. You really? I think this quite, fits quite well. Honestly, the print quality is actually really good. I'm impressed. Oh, this is the black pink thing. One, two, three. Whoa! It worked. And oh, it changes color. Whoa! We didn't even know that. That is so good. This is one of my favorite things I've got. You know what? I ha I've not I've not been disappointed so far. What is this? What is this? <laughs> what the? What? Oh, I think this is the thing that you go like this. Is that for line? Yeah. I don't know why they recommended it to me and I was like, oh, you know what, why not? Is this how you wear it? Like this? They were like, this is one of our popular sellers. And I was like, all right, then I'll get one too. I think I was, ow, ow, ow. Why do I look feel like I'm on a neck brace or something? Oh, it comes out this side now. Oh, jeez. You know what, I don't want a jawline. Um, I, I'm all about self-love and loving yourself as how you are. You know what I mean? It's okay, we don't need a jawline. It's okay. Let's put it back on. Let's put it back on. <laughs> So this is the before, this is what my jaw looks like and hopefully in a week's time I'll look like Zendaya. <sighs> I don't look like Zendaya. I don't know, it's a bit sus. I feel like I got scammed. If anything I'm kind of concerned it's going to give me sticky out ears. Oh, I tell you what, there's no better feeling than the sweet release of a jawline contraption maker. I feel like this is a placebo effect. Like, I feel like this doesn't actually do anything. Or maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. You tell me. But I think I'm telling myself it works because, well, I forced myself to put it on for a week. Say hello to my new jawline. Is it though, or am I just... I don't know, did it do anything? I feel like it didn't really do anything. Do I now have a sharp jawline? You know what, I think I kind of do. What the hell? Did this actually work? I don't know, you tell me. Have you noticed any different? Let me know in the comment section below. Right, next one. <gasps> Wireless charger. This is actually really good because I can charge. So I have a Pixar and an iPhone. Pixar I use mostly for work and this is just like my personal one. And I can actually charge both these phones with the case on using the wireless charger. <gasps> Do you see that? And then the iPhone. There we go and it charges. So I just need one charger for two different phones now. Sorted. Turns out I didn't learn from my last Wish video because I still can't read. So as you guys know, I got very excited about getting a wig. The wig has arrived and so has Susan. <laughs> it wasn't a wig. It was a doll wig for you to practice doing hair stuff on it. Sadly, I will not be having my wig moment in this video. I know, I'm sure you're all as sad as I am, but um, you know, it's beautiful, gorgeous. Can you imagine? I just, oh wow, just imagine. Oh my God, just imagine if I was like that. I think she's a Barbara. Let's go with Barbara. So I shall continue playing. Um, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna learn and practice try and do different hairstyles on Barbara because it's something that I'm not able to do with my hair. All right then, Barbara, what are we feeling like today then, hun? What do you want to go for? Space buns. Ooh, good shout, good shout. I do love a good space bun moment. Have I tried doing a space bun on my hair? Sadly, I don't have the hair for that, but you know what, I'm not bitter. I'm not bitter. I shall live my hair goal dreams vicariously through you. I must say, Barb, you do have beautiful, gorgeous hair. 
I'm almost jealous. I am. I am. I look at it and I just think it must be so much fun. Honestly. You know what? If my neighbours can hear me, they're going to think I've gone psycho. You no, know, they're going to be like, that girl, she's been up in that flat for like eight, nine months and now she's talking to herself out loud. It's not right. We've got a cool. That's actually quite cool. This is who I'd want to be like. I just, oh wow, look how cool it is in the back. Next one. I picked this up last minute. It's basically a little microphone. And I want to test the quality because I want to see if this is actually quite good. This is my Zoom recorder. Oh, it doesn't work. So normally, if it was working, you can see the levels moving here, but it doesn't. So it's not moving, which means nothing's happening and it's just, there's no sound at all. Well then, what was the point of this? What did I pay for? So that has been the review of the Wish microphone mic. It was a fail. It's time to test the sandwich maker. Okay, I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, I kind of regret buying this because Oh my God, can you hear that noise? Low key think there's something wrong with my fridge, but when is there not? Pretend we didn't hear that, stay in denial and move on. Cost like 20 quid, or maybe even 30 quid. I don't know what I was thinking about, because you can get an electrical sandwich maker for that price. So I don't know why I got this. One, two, three. Oh, that's stunning. It doesn't stick it together. So eating this is gonna be fun. Especially because it's beans, it's gonna go everywhere. Ha! Oh, that was dumb. Oh, told you it'd be bad. It's the, the bean sauce goes all over the place and it's just a very painful experience. Tastes good though. So it's low key worth the pain. I wouldn't recommend this. I think you can get better electric sandwich makers that do a much better job in my humble opinion. This is really sharp, so I've got to be careful, but it's actually the perfect size. So I use this part to twirl it, and you keep going until you go further and further in. Oh, wow. That is so satisfying. Oh my God, that's clean. Look at that, that's such a good job. I am so genuinely impressed right now. This is, this is a game changer. p.m. Yeah, it's so dark outside that I feel like it's nighttime. I have just made myself pasta with salad. This is my dinner. I'm gonna now, <coughs> I'm gonna eat now. So, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I love you lots. Please know that you matter and I shall see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. Mitch link in bio. Bye. <laughs>